Hey! Did you fucking find him? Get back here! You're not even hidden! Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. Oh! Ooh. I thought you said you weren't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's two Michael Townleys living in L.S. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut then up I before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta, about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda. Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo! Oh! <laughs> Don't you ever not tell me things I want to know! Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard! Get out here! We're going to Los Santos! Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money. And tidy my shit up. Let's go, Wade, come on. I'm driving. <laughs> you can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna stop for ice cream? I'd like ice cream. I'd like a lot of things. I'm fucking hungry. So, so we're headed to Los Santos then? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? <laughs> Wade, you might have a little bit of specialties in the brain. Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He bumped in with his girlfriend in some place called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's your stop? Family's important, Wade. Not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seeing him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay. Okay, um... That might be nice, but where are we stopping on the way? Perfect. Yeah, he still avoided it. Another chapter of the lost have descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn and maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Trevor, I I, I don't think we'd be welcome there. I mean, what can you want to well send them on their way to begin with? That's the point, Wade! A beautiful way of bringing folk together, Wade. Just you wait. And besides, <laughs> I brought them gifts. Some good guys? Like flowers or Okay. <laughs> Wade. Uh, you amuse me, Wade. You and your high levels of Camps up here. positivity. Up dark before I drop in again. Okay, but it's storming. Wouldn't it be nice to storm, you know, attack while it's storming? All dramatic and shit like that. It's still storming. Wow, that lasted a while. Yeah, a whole so fucking day. They slipped. Ice took a hold of this whole place. You're lost, but you are not forgotten, brothers. We'll find that motherfucker. It's okay, I found you guys. <laughs> I got you them bombs and that pistol with the thing that makes it quiet on it. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts for these pricks. Wait here. Don't get killed. Don't be long. Okay, sticky bombs and a silenced pistol. Fuck yeah. Has he got a pal around him, or... What? Let's see. I could just, you know, stealthily take him out. Oh, put his head's back up. Shut the fuck up. Okay, we gotta go plant some sticky bombs around this place. I don't know where the rest of his friends are, but I'll find him. When I find him... Mm-hmm. You can sure as hell know. They'll die as well as the rest of them. Right. Just gotta keep an eye out. Never know where they could be. 
Okay. Let's just go ahead and put this here. Get close to the trailer and aim with the left trigger. And then press R2 to throw the bomb. That works. Are they leaving now? Oh shit. <laughs> the only guys out here are brothers of the Lost Motorcycle Club. Brothers, I might add, but you are morally obligated to bang the shit out of them. Ha! <laughs> are they gonna turn around here? No, okay. Is he gonna keep talking to her? Because, uh, I got a little present for him. It's in the shape of a bullet. <laughs> hey baby! I'm clean! I want to do one! I just want a hand job! You can't get something from that! That's the case! You would be gross and dead man one last tug! It's cruel! A unusual. Uh. There's something weird in the air. Might be that creepy dealer. Shit, he's still alive? Fuck! How do you fucking fuck? Shit! That's not good. That's not good at all. Well, I tried to do it sneaky, but I guess if you guys want me to go loud, I can go a little bit faster. Fucking asshole, I punched him. I tried to do a stealthy punch, but instead I did a little weak ass bullshit punch. Get out of town, you assholes. Should've just shot him. Would've been easier. We're ready for him this time. Are you really? Fuck off. Go, fuck off. Alright. Have a good one, bitches! Woo! I blew up your girls, how's that make you feel? <laughs> They're certainly fucking damned, that's alright! Shit, really? Alright. Suck a cock, you're not even hiding properly! He ain't gonna do it! I fucking ran him down. Okay. I'm taking this car. It's nice. And huge. Bravado! Why does it gotta be in cursive, man? Can't read this cursive shit. Bravado something something. At least now I want to get a chance to actually, like, sit down and go, what? Oh well. Hey, girl! <laughs> it shows a really terrible place to live. Road, Wadey. Los Santos, here we come. That go okay? I heard lots of banging, like screaming, but then not, not the nice kind. Yeah, it was good, Wade. <laughs> We don't have to think about the loss no more. Let's go find my old buddy. This All right. This local Townley guy must have pissed you off real bad for you to want to find him so much. He didn't piss me off. The guys that killed him, the federal government, they pissed me off. But if he's dead, who's this? Now you're starting to grasp the pertinent questions. Who is this guy using my dead friend's tired ass movie quotes? With my dead friend's alias, and my dead friend's family, and a house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions. Wow, that's a real mindfuck. Yeah, I'll show you a fucking mindfuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye, it's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean anything by that, P. Trevor? Lube up your eye hole, fucker, cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? Oh, oh don't, don't do that. I'm gonna turn you into roadkill. Please, don't turn me into anything! 
I just want to be way. <laughs> He's so innocent Are and naive. Are we there yet? No way. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all. Can you tell me a story? <laughs> no, Wade. Let's play a game then. You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll no. I'm nanotechnology. What? Uh, you're what? <laughs> Damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, hey, hey. How about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tri Tri uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. <laughs> weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent, charisma, and guile that a boy could have. But he didn't know what to do with it. He should become a baseball player. No, he shouldn't. Because he's not a fucking sellout idiot. Or hockey player. He did for a while, but his coach accidentally had a stick jammed up his ass. What could he do? I'll tell you in a second, okay? Just let me concentrate on the road. The Trevor! Hey! Aww. <laughs> hey, yeah, come on. I want to hear your fucking origin story, Trevor. We're getting pretty fucking close. Yep, and there's Los Santos. That giant sprawl. Los Santos. Oh! Get you get! Get you get! I like that, yeah! Whoops! Sorry! Oh, this is Los Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert. It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, the city's pretty nice. Look at it. It's so beautiful. You got tallish buildings, taller buildings than those. They're all lit up at the nighttime. It's nice. And then once we get to Michael's place, we'll have a real interesting time having a good discussion with our old dead friend. All right, come on, Wade. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life. It's been nearly ten years. Oh, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You motherfucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Maybe... Maybe Michael should've changed his name for Michael, huh? Just saying. Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? It's this Fuji Beach where he's staying. Will you tell me the story? About that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? You were saying what he could do. He, he couldn't throw, and his coach had a, had a stick accident like, like I had one. Right, right. But he could fly planes, this kid. So he signed up to the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe just maybe drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable. Grounded him for life. That's Ouch. terrible. It yeah. Was. Sent him into a deep pit of doubt and despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. M Michelle. A lady troll? Yeah, he had tits like one, but no, no, he was <laughs> a boy. Michelle <laughs> is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people, and little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. And they fell in lust. 
and he bought her a pair of fake troll tits, even bigger than his real troll tits, so <laughs> she could make more money stripping, and maybe a little on the side without call work, but you didn't hear that from me. Wow. And then she pushed out a pair of little trolls, and the big bad troll under the bridge went soft. Hold on, what? So little Trevor made a new friend called Brad, and he was thinking about cutting Mike off when it all went to shit, and Mike got killed and Brad went to jail. Did all the names just change, or am I missing something? Shut up! And then the fat, ugly troll came back from the dead, and the news picked it up. Our hero decided to go out looking for him. I'm sort of following it, I think. But what happens in the end? Oh, oh! We're near Floyd's house. I've seen it on I find maps. I'll give you directions. I I I know where I'm going, pal. It's straight here. Just oh. keep on a minute. So we got some character so, development now shit. Now here's like a right. Shut up. Now keep going. Trevor! I mean, this that's me. Place. I think it is at least. Yeah, whatever, Wade. You got me all like confused about everything. Cause you're all confused. That's how I feel about it, at least. It's up here, Trevor. All right. I don't know why it took me so long to get out of the fucking car. Uh, I wonder what Floyd's Wade? like. Who? Me, Wade, your cousin. Who? Your cousin. Uh -huh. Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck. Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink. Oh, you wait. <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here. He's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. You can't smoke here. Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was called Neville's bed. A guy was never proved. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend, she'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah, okay. Wait, uh, I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go, too. <laughs> Damn. Ah. Floyd's apartment can now be used as a safe house. Yeah. Cool, okay. Sucks for Floyd, but hey, let's check out his girl. Friends reunited. Mystery gift? I want a mystery gift, hey! Oh, Maybe it was a mystery gift if I, uh... ...did it without getting detected. Yeah, that was probably it. Okay, so... In some pictures, the girlfriend doesn't have glasses. That's so weird. Not all available to switch between- COOL! I like glasses. Glasses are nice. Or at least glasses on girls. Glasses on girls are nice. What the fuck does he have in this house? For a wardrobe, that is. Let's see. Save the game. Oh uh, yeah, saving the game! Uh, but first let me check out the clothes. I'll probably keep this one, but, you know, might as well see what's here. Do you really only have, like, a bunch of white t-shirts? That's silly. Black hoodie... Black cargo pants. Ooh, actually, that's kind of cool. I like. Uh, I like darkish colors. I don't know why. Uh, I just do. Although I don't want to look like a fucking, you know, super ninja queer or some shit. Yeah, we'll be fine. Time to save. Oh yeah. Haven't had you know any other characters rest in a while. There you go. Ah, Los Santos! We are back in you, baby! Uh, that sounds weird. Now I can swap between all the people. But, you know what? I am going to take a slight little break here. And when we get back, um... We'll see what's going on with everybody else. So be right back. <laughs> 